again with a healthy and wealthy day. Myself, Nazara Fatima, a member of OnFix Youth Forum and a management student. Every individual has a story to tell, every business has a lesson to share, and every interview has an empowering and inspiring message. We are at RK Transship Forwarders, located at Shivalinga Colony, Old Airport Road, Bengaluru, for Rise Up Entrepreneurship Series, powered by OnFix. Now we have Ms. Janyaneshwar Reddy with us. Let's hear about this entrepreneurship journey. Good morning, sir. Glad to have you with us today. Can you please tell us about yourself and your business? See, I just completed my education and uh, I had a friend who had wanted to get into business. And I started off, uh, I mean, he ventured out into this cargo business of what we are presently in. And initially I was his employee, later I became his partner in the same organization. We started off with a very small uh, staff with just four of us. And this is, at the moment this company is almost 22 years old. And uh, I have a personal experience of close to 28 years. This company is, like I said, it is 22 years old. And we are into imports and exports customs clearance mm. since then one of the top most leading agents here in Bangalore. That's very good to hear, sir. And what is your favorite aspect of being an entrepreneur? See, there is always success, provided you work hard. And it's not something that just to, what you call it, make money. It's not a five by night business that we are into. This is a business which we happen to expand at the same time. We have presently branches in Bangalore, Chennai and Hyderabad and we have just started off in Mumbai and probably we are planning in the next year, we are planning to open up in Calcutta and Delhi also. That's a very wide range sir. Uh, so can I know what are your business goals? My business goals initially when we started off we were thinking too big but as the market is we have grown. Definitely we have grown almost about 50%. We have crossed beyond our limits. What we actually thought of was something which we actually never realized that we could dream about. It was basically those days we were dreaming about it. And today I can say that I have accomplished it being in this business. Oh, okay. That's very good to hear, sir. Okay, where do you see yourself in next five years? Five years, we are uh, planning operations back in India. Oh, that is very huge. Uh, what inspired you to start your business and what's your unique selling point, sir? See, what, I mean, when I, like I said previously, I used to work as an employee and then uh, later I became a partner because my USP today is, I have a passion for service. That's my USP. And I love doing service. I mean, this is of course commercial thing. Even uh, otherwise, I have this attitude where I have to do service in general. And uh, I don't interfere much, actually speaking, the company's operation because everything is systematic. We have streamlined the entire operations team. We have separate departments for each and every imports, we have separate division. Exports, we have a separate division. Accounts is a separate division. And uh, for uh, HL, which we've been handling for the last 20 years, we have a separate division only to handle HL shipments and other aerospace uh, companies. And at the same time, we have I already achieved 500 invoices per month so far. We are looking at 1,000 is our next target. That's it. Wow. Yeah. Uh, what was your first objective when you founded your business? My first objective was actually to handle only Bangalore operations. But then later we went into expansion. We started off in Hyderabad. Now uh, people started asking us, why don't you do it in some port? Then we went into Chennai. And now uh, we have gone to another port that is Mumbai. Uh, Tritikoran is in place. Mm -hmm. Right now we are planning to start there. Then after that it is going to be Calcutta and then Delhi. Okay, all right, sir. Uh, how was your experience prepared for this role? See, this particular trade is actually, it's a learning process. 
we have to understand the client never say that we have understood their business that is the focal thing we have to understand what exactly their requirement is even though i like i said i this organization is almost i have been personally in spread for the last 20 years and this company is 22 years old i have to look at the requirement of the client i cannot say i know everything about your business i have to understand what exactly his requirement is and based on that i have to fulfill his desires if it is possible to achieve uh, so sir what is your greatest professional achievement when we initially started off we started off with domestic cargo and uh, we have backed awards from the existing three airlines those days that is Indian Airlines, Sara Airlines and Jet Airways three consecutive years as South India's best agent award wow. for domestic travel. Okay. Uh, what additional skill or experience will help you succeed in your business role? Every day is a learning process. It's just as simple as that because in our trade every day the government keeps changing rules and we have to be updated on the same. For us, we have something called as exim policies and all that, export import policies and all that. We have to keep ourselves updated about it. And based on that, we will have to fulfill it to the customers or our clients. And we have to tell them these are the options that you have. You can choose them. Or we have to tell them which is the best option. That is the reason why we have retained most of our clients so far. 95% of our clients are stuck to us only because of this. Because we educate them also. With regard to the government policies. Uh, so, uh, can you please share us uh, a word or two about your experience with OnFix? OnFix is a very good platform and friendly at the same time. I, we were never into marketing. Honestly, if I have to be very open, we were never actually into marketing. But because of the lockdown, mm, yeah, which hit us badly, we had to get into marketing because we were scared of losing out and we had to make up for the loss that uh, was actually accumulated because of the lockdown. So we started marketing and Orfix is one of the most uh, what you call professional and friendly uh, networking group that I've joined so far. Thank you. Thank you for that sir. Uh, thank you sir for such an inspiring story. Your entrepreneurial journey can motivate many aspiring entrepreneurs. Thank you for being with Onfix. Looking forward for a healthy relationship and best wishes for your future endeavors, sir. Thank you.